so I've just come outside to do a video titled something like taking pic good pictures in bad weather and it starts raining the moment I step outside. I mean, welcome to Britain. Okay, so no, it's not a different day. I'm still, I'm still out. You can probably hear the rain. Uh, it's quite heavy now. I'm determined to get this video done. So we're gonna film inside the woods, well, in the woods. And then I'll try and get some photos back in the field um, when we start moving around again. But whilst, we, whilst I'm talking to the camera, I want to be, keep it dry, just in case it, um, I don't want it to get damaged, you know. I didn't really include rain as bad weather, but I think it does sort of count. It's not really bad. I was more meaning lighting and compared to golden hour, this lighting isn't the best, but we'll go with rain as well because it is quite annoying right now. Um, and then thirdly, why am I doing this? Well, I wanted to do a video like this because I've seen a lot of on Instagram about sunrises, sunsets and that sort of thing. You've probably seen it as well. And I want to sort of, I understand that um, photography is better. It can be like better for photos and that, and that conditions, the wow factors there. But I realistically think that in this weather like this where it's loads of clouds and it's raining, you can get some really awesome shots still. So that's what I want to show because as a beginner, that's something I've sort of realized as I've been taking photos. So. We'll start moving around. I might try and get some shots in the woods first, um, but I have a few tips, so let's get going. So the first thing I would say is, as much as the lighting isn't the best compared to a golden hour or something, the lighting is still actually very interesting, especially if you can get in a wood or somewhere um, with trees or something above your head, just um, that diffracts the light a bit. It's actually, if you look up, it's pretty interesting in terms of the lighting, even though it's not bright and it's not uh, sort of yellow and golden, it's still really interesting. So I'd say somewhere like this here is an example. I don't know how to describe it really, but it's just, it's interesting lighting um, and it can make them for some really moody shots and sort of mysterious sort of shots. So yeah. I don't know what it is about the lighting when it's raining and overcast, but it's really nice. It makes for some magical shots, so definitely get out. I'd recommend getting out when it is like this. So the first tip I would say is definitely remember the lighting. It's still very important, even though it might not look that good just when you're walking along, it's still very important. And second thing is, especially when it's raining um, and also when it's just moody skies, the actual stuff, the stuff around you is pretty useful, like foreground and just different things to add in your photo can be really cool. For example, these leaves here, um, you can sort of see uh, there's sort of like there's raindrops all over them and this can actually be really useful so if you can use that in your photo which you wouldn't be able to get on a really warm sunny day or evening then yeah definitely use that I do realize this has sort of turned into a what to photograph in the woods when it's raining type of video but still I hope it's of interest um, I have one more tip that I'm gonna try and show you but yeah it's, it is really nice going in the woods I definitely recommend it when it is raining um, just the the lighting and stuff but this is also just for when it is rainy and moody and bad weather in general. Now the last tip I wanted to just emphasize is that when the weather isn't that good and the lighting isn't exactly perfect one thing to really keep in mind is your composition because you really want to have something interesting because when it's something like a sunset or a sunrise I think you can get away with not having such a good composition because people will be just amazed by it anyway. So when the weather isn't that good, you have to have something that will draw people in still. So having a really good composition will help. Um, just as I've sort of come down, I've been coming down through a path up there. Um, and now I've just come to this little bit with a bridge. I think you can just see it there. So I'm gonna try and get a shot there to finish it off. Um, and hopefully this has been helpful because it's a bit different to normal. So if you like it, then subscribe if you're new. Um, but hopefully it is. Please leave a comment if it did help or you need any more help. Uh, yeah, and I'll see what I can get here.